Hello and welcome back everyone to Human Resource Machine. We are going to take a look at year 37, the scavenger chain. So here each pair on the floor contains either data, uh, well it contains both data and the address of another one of those pairs. Um, a scramble chain, yeah well. Each thing in the inbox is an address of one of the pairs. Outbox the data for that pair and also data in the following pairs in the chain. The chain ends when you when you reach a negative address. So basically only if you hit this field because otherwise you wouldn't ever get a negative address. Mm, so the idea is I take from the inbox. This is an index on the floor. So that's why I created this field index. I just copy it to that index field otherwise I can't use it as an address unfortunately. Um, I copy from what is indexed by that or addressed by that. Um, so in this case it's zero. Um, I would take the E, put that to the outbox, then bump up my index to get the next field which holds the next address and then copy from what's in that um, indexed field which is this. Copy that back to the index because that's our new index we want to use. So we would now have 13 in this one. Um, copy from what's indexed at, at 13, which would be the S. Outbox the S. Bump up the index again to go to 14. Have the new address. Copy that back to the index field. Um, then take from 3. 3 would be the C. Outbox that and so on and so forth. So let's just have a quick look. So we initiate our, our index from the inbox. We get our E. Outbox it. We bump up to get the new index to find our new index we want to then actually use. Copy that back to our index field. Take from the new address, which is the S. Outbox it. Bump up our index to get the new address. Copy that new address back. Take from that new address, which is the C in this case. Then bump up the index, get our new address, copy that back, take from there, and then just go on like that. And we get escape. So now we hit, um, that's maybe a little bit interesting. So once we hit, uh, once we outbox the E, we get uh, 21 as our address, which brings us here, um, which is this case, jump if negative. So the, the instruction said that once we hit a negative index, we are supposed to stop or, well, take the next input. And that's what we do here. We check for jump if negative and then go right back to the start. And now we have the A, bump up our index, get the 10. Get the P, go to 11, which leads us to 20, and so we got the escape ape. Hit the, the minus one, and that's our decoded word, scavenger chain. We have exactly eight commands, and we had exactly 63 for the speed challenge. And that's just 37. Uh, see you next time.